Hello, 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 hello guys, hello guys, this is Willie Gates Africa. Today I'm going to show you how to make a simple, simple, very simple beat in Reason 5 propeller head. Very simple, basics and straightforward. It's very easy guys. Uh, people they say, no, eh, Reason, eh, I can't use Reason, it's, it's very, very, very complicated. Yeah, this is, nothing is complicated. I'm going to show you how to do it and I'm going to show you how simple it is. But before I do that, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe and press that button so that you get all the notifications. So let's get down and do the magic. Let's go. Okay. So this is a, a reason a five. This is the the, the rack and this is the uh, sequencer. So let's detach it. So this is how the, the sequencer looks like. Okay. So I've played some of these instruments already, so I'm gonna just be showing you how I did all this without wasting time. I'm gonna be very, 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 very fast, and I'm gonna be showing you exactly what I did for me to come up with this. See, this is what I came up with. show you real quick and fast it's simple very easy very easy very easy okay so when i opened reason uh, the rack was empty so i right click uh, and then i i created like um i created a redrum computer you see this is then i clicked it and then after that i had this redrum computer then i pressed tab so when you open it it will be like this it will be uh, like this it will be empty up to channel number 10 it will be like this you see uh, so this output will be here uh, what's happening sorry about that okay Okay, so it will be empty like this. You will have only this, like this. So what I did, uh, I disconnected this, then I routed from one to channel number one. This is the, the read drum. Okay. Uh -huh. So you're gonna have like two cables here, it's for stereo. If it's one, it's gonna sound only, the sound will come to your left. If the other one is going to gonna sound the right, so it's stereo. So. You need to connect both of those cables like you need to route them you see there are two the other one on top the other one down so up to channel number 10 so that our drum is separately well channeled in each and every channel to the mixer so that when mixing you don't have problem you can mix well your drum so as you can see now our drums are well separated down to each and every channel so that you can mix them separately for mixing anyway so let's go to, let's go to our sequencer so this is our sequencer as you can see we have click here this is where you get the metronome if you switch it on like this then it's gonna give you um the metronome let me switch off everything so that again you see this is the, this is our metronome so this is the pre it's a pre count if you want to record if you press record it will count up to three then you start recording and we have our click this is the click level uh, uh, this is the click level and we have this uh, navigating panel here if you want to stop if you want to go forward a bar you use this previous rewind and fast forward stop and play record you see here we have tempo tempo is 100 now the default tempo is 120 so our time signature it's four over four so let's go so let me show you how i created this drum um this is the drum line i created So 
thought about this. I don't know how I press this. So, so this is how I created the drum line, as you can see. You see? So this is how I created the drum line. So I added the this other like hi hat. It's simple. If you don't have a MIDI keyboard, you can simply use this tool to draw like this, like this, like this. See, you can draw. So this is how you can draw. So you have to know that. If you don't have the mid keyboard, what you're gonna have uh, before you put uh, you draw your stuff or you play your stuff, you're gonna be having an empty an empty rack like this to be empty. So the one you will be asking yourself, how am I going to play? How am I going to, to draw? What you have to do, you have to pick this pen pen here, the pencil too, then you draw in the blank line here, straight in the drum line there. Then if you have this colored thing. Then you double click it, then you have your your drums. Then you pick your two again here, your pencil, that's where you draw, you see. It's easy, 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 easy. You can all do whatever you wanna do. See? You can do whatever you wanna do. That's how you do it without the MIDI keyboard. So without wasting time, this is how I created my drum. My drum. So this is how I created my drum line. So I created another instrument. So as you can see, our drums are well routed up to track number 10. So number 11, 12, 13, and 14 uh, will be empty. So you right click again. Then you create, I created an instrument, then I went on and selected all instrument patches, then I added piano, then acoustic piano, then I selected concert piano, concert grand piano. Then after that, here is my concert piano here. So here is my piano here, it's written combination. So, after that, then this is what I played. So this is what I played together with the drum. So you can use this fader. Clicked again, then I created in you go and create, then create instrument. I went to Rising Factory Sound Banks, then all instrument pitches, then strings. Then I, I love to use uh, super strings, so I selected super string and paste OK. Then I had my super string here. Then after that. So these are my strings. So I play them like this. So these strings they are nice because I cut off here some high end. So I cut off some uh, high frequency. so that it fills those gaps like you're playing with a sustain pedal you know what I mean so this is how I play the, 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 the strings then I, I edit 
create some chops here. I created an, an edge live from Boston. This is a combinator again. I edit this from from electric guitars. You see, it's an edge. Yeah. Then uh, this is how I play it. Some bass, then I created again another instrument. The work, then I went to basses, then electric basses, then I played a page flip top. So, this is the this is the flip top. Bass. So, this is how I played it, it's very simple. you can find it like you just it's a it's a thaw you know it's called thaw so you create like this then you search you go to all instruments then you search valve then you'll find it then this is how it sounds So you see, it's very easy, it's simple, it's simple, 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 nothing complicated, very simple, simple, simple. So, hey, 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 I wanna make love, I wanna make love, I wanna love you, I wanna love you, I wanna love you, I wanna love you. These guys who can see me can do that as well, but I can't, you know, just make, showing you how to make a simple beat. Please guys subscribe, subscribe. But I'm gonna be dropping more and I'm gonna be showing 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 you 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 how to make hits and you're gonna be making hits. I'm telling you, after watching this, you will be able to make your own beats. Make your own beats anytime, anyway, anyway, anyway. So let's see. Okay. Actually, this is just a simple beat. This is how, how we made a simple beat. You see? So here on our read drum here. Everything is on default. We did not tweak anything. We did not EQ. We did not compress. We did not do anything. It's just everything is just raw, 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 raw. Same applies here. On this instrument, we added the grand piano. We added some strings. Uh, so this, this is a chopping guitar. It's called a live from Boston. And we even added a live bass. This is a bass in an ampage flip top. And we added another mixer because. Uh, our first mixer was full and we did not have any space so we created another mixer, it's a 14.6 mixer uh, we created 14.2 mixer, sorry um, then after that we added our valve so there's nothing like I mixed or I compressed or I did, I put river but not put anything at all there's nothing, it's just dry, everything is dry I was just showing you how to create a simple beat on Reason 5 only so, okay guys this is it. I was just showing you a simple beat. How to create a simple beat. Okay, nothing more. So, thanks for watching. And you guys subscribe because next time I'll be, I'll, I'll be dropping more of these. And I'll be dropping like how to make a beat on different doors. Like on foot loops, uh, on Reason, uh, Cubase. So, 
please comment in my uh, in the comment section there so that i can uh, help you guys or even you can help me where i don't know so this is what i'm sharing with you this is all what i know my knowledge if you think we can collaborate then it's okay it's cool drop your email address or email me or just give me a, a whatsapp then uh, we link up you know yeah anyway this is Willy Gates Africa thanks for watching guys please don't forget to subscribe and share this if you find it if you find this video helpful please drop your comment or press a like so that next time guys I drop more of these I'm out and I'm really out but I'm gonna come back again in a few peace out peace out peace out <laughs>